What's up guys, today's video is on Scotty Cameron Super Select Newport Putter Review 2023. This putter screams extreme quality, as soon as you get your eyes on it, and then that feeling is backed up when you first get it in your hands. I think the new I-beam neck design looks great, and I personally prefer the silver dots on the back of the head compared to classic red. Everyone can remember their first Scotty Cameron. A bit like getting your first car, your first Scotty is probably second-hand and even though it's probably been abused by someone else, it means the world to you when you get it. I've not had many during my 15 years playing golf, so getting my hands on the new Scotty Cameron Super Select Newport for a test was a real treat. I love that Scotty Cameron don't overdesign the putters and keep them really simple. The blade putters look great and have done for many years, so there's no point in making changes for changes' sake. There are some subtle differences between this year's Super Select model and last year's special select. The new I-beam neck design has allowed them to save weight and move it closer to the head's perimeter, making it more forgiving. The cavity dots on the back of the face have also had a slight upgrade. They're now larger, meaning there is less weight in the center of the putter and more near the edges. This doesn't really sound like an upgrade, but as amateurs are not the most consistent ball strikers, it's actually a good deal. This is really noticeable on longer putts, as strikes feel solid on pretty much every shot and ball speed stays consistent making distance control easier. Now I am aware that these changes are pretty small, and if you've only just recently upgraded to the old model, you may not notice a huge difference. But for me, as a non-Scotty Cameron Blade user, it was an eye-opening experience for me. I love the Scotty Cameron Super Select Newport putter shape, with its small head size and curved edges. To me, this is as elegant as it comes in a putter and really feels like the purest form of putting. I had great fun testing the new Newport. I was practically skipping around the green at the Titleist Performance Center at Wabur, knocking in five and six footers for fun. I don't often think about the sound a putter strike makes, but everything about it was brilliant. The new Scotty Cameron Super Select line features a new double face milling which provides the feel of the deep milling they've previously experimented with, with the performance of the more shallow milling they've done in recent years. The outcome is a ball that rolls well and consistently. This putter is well worth checking out when it's released on the 17th of March to the public. To test you will likely have to ask someone to open a locked glass cabinet, and you will feel the urge to be extremely careful when handling it, but I have no doubt you will want it straight in the bag afterward. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button, and if you have something to say, please leave a comment.